In the golden state of California, not everything that glitters is gold. There exist places that can send a chill down your spine, to the land where sunshine meets shadow, where the allure of golden beaches adjoins the eerie whispers of the unknown. Today we're venturing beyond the familiar Californian sights, into the depths of its lesser-known spine-tingling locales, be journeying through eleven of the creepiest places this state has to offer, each with its unique story etched in the annals of time. From the chilling confines of abandoned asylums, to the spectral presence in historic mansions, each location has been hand-picked to send a shiver down your spine. We'll explore the eerie stories and chilling legends that make these places stand out in the vast, diverse landscape of California. Each tale more unsettling than the last, each location a testament to the state's haunted history. So brace yourselves as we embark on this spine-tingling journey. Starting our countdown at number 11, we have the eerie Alcatraz Island, a place of bleak history and haunting tales. This isolated island in the San Francisco Bay was once home to some of the most notorious criminals in American history. Its chilling ambiance is accentuated by the fact that it was considered an inescapable prison. The chilling winds and disquieting calm that beset the island today echo the desperation of its past inmates. Next at number 10, we have the Winchester Mystery House, a mansion that's a labyrinth of mystery and intrigue. This peculiar residence was the brainchild of Sarah Winchester, who believed she was haunted by the ghosts of those killed by the Winchester rifles. Her solution? Build a house to confuse the spirits, with doors leading to nowhere and stairs that end abruptly it's an architectural conundrum that oozes an uncanny vibe. These places sure know how to set a spooky mood. Venturing further into the gloom, taking the ninth spot, we present the eerie Queen Mary ship. The ship's record of opulence magnificence is obvious. An abundance of specters are spotted wandering the ship's deck and corridors. The Fomet is the Lady in White. A spectral figure often seen gracefully in the ship's ballroom. We now turn our sights to the glamour and lights of Hollywood. At number 8 we find the Hollywood Roosevelt Hotel. Known for its celebrity clientele and glittering parties, this hotel also harbors a darker, paranormal side. The hotel's famous ghostly resident is none other than Marilyn Monroe, whose reflection has been seen time and again in a mirror that once hung in her suite. The spirit of Montgomery Clift, another former guest, is said to haunt room 928, where he stayed while filming from here to eternity. These places are sure to give even the bravest a pause. From spectral ships to haunted hotels, California's haunted locations offer a chilling yet intriguing journey into the past, where the line between the living and the dead is blurred. As we delve further into the heart of darkness, number seven brings us to the Mogollon Ghost Town. This desolate locale, once bustling with miners and their families, now lays abandoned, the whispers of its past echoing through the empty streets. A walk through the town is akin to stepping back in time, with the eerily preserved buildings serving as a chilling testament to life in the late 19th century. The silence is deafening, and the feeling of being watched is ever-present. Moving on, let's journey down the sixth most chilling spot, the East Eight Mile Road. This seemingly endless stretch of road is infamous for the Phantom Hitchhiker a spectral figure that many claim to have seen. The spine-chilling tales of encounters with this apparition who vanishes into thin air 
are enough to make even the most hardened travelers think twice about venturing down this road after dusk. Next, let's step inside the fifth most eerie location, the Whaley House. This historic house turned museum is not only a treasure trove of antique artifacts, but also a hotbed for ghostly activity. The Whaley family's spirits are believed to still linger, with visitors reporting strange occurrences, from unexplained cold spots to the faint sound of piano music wafting through the air. Finally, we arrive at number four, the infamous Black Star Canyon. This secluded canyon is steeped in a dark history, from bloody battles to mysterious disappearances. The chilling legends and persistent rumors of ghostly sightings have earned Black Star Canyon a reputation as one of the creepiest places to visit in California. It's a place where daylight seems to struggle against an unseen force, where the air is thick with an unsettling silence, and where the shadows seem to dance with a life of their own. And now the moment you've been waiting for, or perhaps dreading, the top three creepiest places in California. Sliding into the third spot is the Amargosa Opera House. Nestled deep in the heart of Death Valley, the Opera House was once a bustling hub of culture and artistry. However, its history is mared with tales of ghostly apparitions and eerie whispers. The chilling tale of a lonely dancer who never left the stage even in death is enough to send shivers down anyone's spine. To this day, visitors report unexplainable incidents, making this opera house a must-visit for thrill-seekers and ghost hunters. On to the top two, we venture to the Linda Vista Hospital in Los Angeles. Once a beacon of hope and healing, it now stands as a haunting reminder of the past. Tales of phantom patients and spectral surgeons echo through the deserted halls, adding an undeniable creepiness to the abandoned medical facility. It's said that the spirits of those who didn't survive their treatment still roam the hospital forever trapped in their final moments of life. And finally, we arrive at the number one spot, the infamous Cecil Hotel. With a long history of suicides, murders, and residents of infamy, including serial killers, the Cecil Hotel tops the list. Its dark and twisted past has earned it the title of the most haunted hotel in California. The tales of the unexplained events and the eerie feeling of being watched make it the epitome of creepiness. These are the places where nightmares come to life. And there you have it, the 12 creepiest places to visit in California, from eerie abandoned towns to haunted hotels. Each location holds its own unique chill, a testament to the rich and sometimes chilling history of the Golden State. Whether it's the allure of the unknown or the thrill of the scare, these places beckon the brave and the curious. Remember, thrill seekers, sometimes the things that scare us the most are also the ones that intrigue us. Stay curious, stay brave, and as always, keep exploring.